the GEC the largest student community in Vancouver. It's great to be able to be your host today. My name is Kaba and I'm with the GEC marketing team. Um, so we're going to be touring the Pearson building today. And um, but before I start talking about the fact that we're in right now, um, I do want to mention a couple of things. So we will draw a winner from the chat section today for a hundred dollar Apple gift card. So if you have any questions at all or any comments at all, you feel free to um, write as much as you want and we will pick your winner from the chat section. Um, and let's go over the units that we're going to be seeing today first. Um, so after the shade of this room and the outside of the building, um, we're going to go to the premium studio which can host up to three people. Um, it is approximately 500 uh, square feet, and it is going to be at $2,400 uh, rent for the premium studio. And for Pearson, and then we're going to see the Student Lounge, which is not a rental, but it is a space available for each and every one of you. And there's going to be a PlayStation there, um, some board games. You are able to cook with your friends. So um, that's a space that we want to have for students so they can hang out with um, their fellow residents over there. And lastly, we're going to see the section studio, which approximately is about 450 square feet. It hosts um, two to three people, ideally two people, and it costs $1,200. Um, from a four months day. So, uh, first of all, I'm going to show you the fitness center and we're going to start the room over here. And hopefully, you'll enjoy the tour. Please let us know if you have any questions at all. There, is, there are a lot of equipment available to your community. Require a little bit of arrangement. Um, you can do a lot of pull down, uh, you can do spot right here, or you can use a bench and um, just a pet fly here. Really. So there's lots that you can do with this equipment. We have PA over here, and we have three different hardware machines over here with a now and uh, For example, this pet machine. Okay, power. Cool. Honestly, there's a lot of wind in Vancouver today, which is, uh, which we're very thankful for because it's been really hot. Uh, but it might cut off the sound, so we'll try our best. Okay, so this area here is available for you, and you can have. A picnic, lunch with your friends, and you or you can use this space as a barbecue space. Um, so we have a lot of outdoor seating. One here, and then we have another one just over there. So Pearson was actually built in, built in 2016, and we have two residences. Um, residence one here. And residence two over here. And they both have six floors. Um, so, and let's just go back in and I'll show you residence one first. We have a very uh, exciting smart locker system in Residence One. Um, it is very cool because you can just uh, receive any mail that you have here with a passcode, and you can also send mail with a passcode as well. So I'm going to show you how to use it. So first, um, we just click Start. There are a lot of languages available. If it's, we'll do English today. 
and we will do a the um, power up. And we'll choose uh, anything where So it just requires a phone number first. So I'm going to do that right now. And then you need to repeat the phone number just to confirm. And then we click enter. So uh, I'm going to choose a small locker. There are different lockers available if you have bigger packages. You can And then just open. <laughs> okay. Uh, now we're gonna close this. Okay. I'll I'll do the. You just click uh, click, and then uh, just receive the code on my phone here. And then you enter your password. There you go. That's where you can pick up your database. So this is the entrance lobby area for residence one. And we have a tenant charging station here. So when you uh, use the UV, and um, we do have security here in person, but their hours are a little bit different. So you might not see them all the time, but they are here for sure. And we also have cameras installed all over our buildings um, so that we feel safe. And here is the caretaker's office, 101. Um, Jalal is our caretaker here at GV. So he'd be the first contact person if you stay here. He would help you with um, check-ins and check-outs and um, any other inquiries you might have. Um, Jalal is your go-to person. He also assists with um, packaging as well because this, sometimes there are big packages that don't fit into the smart locker system. I would like to show you the living area first and then we can just move back on here and show you the bathroom and um, other things we have available. So there is a short stairway here. And if you go down, this is the studio space. So you have your little um, living room area here, and then you have your uh, bedroom area. So this is a queen bed available for you. And um, the bedding and towels are included within a premium seat. So whatever you see here today will be available for you. And um, just to go over what is included at GEC, all of our suites are fully furnished. Uh, so you don't pay extra for everything in the room uh, and furniture, you don't pay extra. We have Wi-Fi, you don't have to pay extra for Wi-Fi and utilities are included. So, so like electricity, water, everything is included. Um, we have, like I mentioned, on-site management, our caretaker, um, security, and we also have underground parking. If you do have a car, you are free to use the underground parking. And um, marketing team, so myself, Julie, and Luffy, we also host um, events for our students. 
Right now, it is mostly virtual events, but um, as the restrictions loosen, I believe they will try to host in-person events as well. Um, but right now, that's the safest option. So yeah, this is for PVET. And then um, over here, you can see the uh, kitchen if you would like to uh, cook. And we do provide plates, um, cups, and everything that you see here. So you have the dishwasher, um, which is something that you don't actually get in most of the rentals in Vancouver. So this is really good to have. If you don't like doing dishes, it's great. Um, you have an oven, still top for cooking, it's electronic. Um, and a microwave. And you have a fridge here. Uh, and maybe I can just talk a little bit about the um, living room space as well. So the couch here we have is actually convertible, so you can use it as a bed to host another person with you. And you have a nice big flat end screen. And so this room actually can accommodate up to two people. So two people in the bed, and if you want to have one more person here. Um, ideally, probably two people, but you are able to live here with three people. Um, and I can show you the bathroom. Yeah, the good thing about premium apartments, they have uh, private entrances from outside and you get a nice balcony area as well. And the ceiling is very high here compared to some of the other rooms. So it feels like there's a lot of space. Okay. And this would be um, your wardrobe. If you decide to stay in this dinner, it's very big. So there's a lot of space here. And here is your washer and dryer. So you do have in suite washer and dryer, and we have this for all of our units. You don't have to pay extra at all. Um, and this studio actually comes with a bin. So you have a small space here and you can use it whatever way you like. So we decorated it to be used as an office space. So you could study here for your classes, just, it's kind of nice to have. And over here is the bathroom. You have a bathtub and you can also use it as a shower, but you can have a shower head. Um, and we also have hair dryers in all of our units. So you don't have to bring a hair dryer to DC. And for the premium studios, again, we will collect towels. So you, you also don't need towels. Um, are there any questions about this uh, premium suite at all? What's the cost of this studio? It is twenty four hundred per month. Up to up to four months. You can accommodate up to three people here because I um, mean have two people in the queen bed and uh, one person in the convertible sofa. Yeah, that's okay, I think that's it. And it's also good to mention that um if you choose to stay in a private suite, you it, they are pet friendly, so you can um, we can accommodate your pet, no problems. Okay, so now we can move upstairs and go see our studio. So this is
So we're going to be getting into the elevator right now. We're sorry you took the connection cuts, but we'll be back shortly. Okay, so upon entry, um, we have some space available here, but we will hopefully have, uh, we plan to have a sanitizing station here. Um, so hopefully we can show you that once it's um, all arranged. And just as I said, this uh, apartment is going to be used as a student lounge and it will be available late July, so we are still uh, setting up some of the details, but I will show you the rooms, but they will be turned into an office space, um, a study area. So um, you could, when you need some quiet time or you just need to um, study alone, you can just be here, or um, if you also need to study with your friends and you have a group project, you can just use these spaces available. But like I said, right now they are um, showing for for uh, the bedroom. What's the distance to New West, and uh, how far mm -hmm. how long is it? Uh, yes. uh, that's I think that's about thirty minutes. I'm gonna say uh, maybe longer. Well, for New West, actually, this accommodation we have it for. The Richmond schools usually, and it is close to BCIT. And um, I have it in my notes Langara, UBC, and TPU. So for New West, um, I would say it's going to be further, um, maybe 30 to 40 minutes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Again, like this space is a showroom only right now, it will be turned into study room. And I'll show you this one over here. And yeah, same thing, this will also be a study. And this is the student lounge, welcome. So you can use the kitchen space here if you would like to cook with your friends or other residents, it's all available. Um, we will have cups, plates, cutlery, everything you will need to cook, um, pots and pans as well. And here is the sort of room here. And we're gonna have a PlayStation here. So you can um, connect it and play games. And we already have a selection of board games that you can use and hopefully we will come more before we open this space to students. We have Jenga, chess, Monopoly, so lots of stuff. And you can use this table um, if you would like to have food with your friends. And I think the best thing about the student lounge is that um, you can have barbecues here. So I'll show you that outside. Which which do you see residents you suggest for New West? Which one? I mean, honestly, like it is a 30, minute, 30 to 40 minute um, Sky train, so any of them would work. Potentially, it would be easier from the downtown location, Viva. But I would say um, maybe just connect us on social media or just um, email our reservations team at reservations at gc11.com 
I mean, we can have a look and make sure which one is closer because I can't just tell off the top of my head right now. But I, I like just thinking about it now, I'm thinking we run like 80 best. Um, so let's just move outside and I'll show you the uh, barbecue area. Um, just in case if you don't hear me in there, um, if I say something interesting, I can just repeat it here. Weather is the best today. Wow. So the balcony here is super large. This is and a lot more space here. Wow. So yeah, this barbecue is for our students. Whenever you want to come here and use it, have a little get together. Um, I think it's amazing, and there's such a nice view outside as well. So I would totally come here and hang out if I live here. So I will talk a little bit about the attraction. We are um, with JC Pearson. We are 15 minutes to the Richmond Center, which is a huge shopping mall. And there are lots of um, restaurants and Richmond is actually um, a really good place to get Asian food. Um, there is lots there. Um, and we are very close to the Marine Drive Skytrain Station and Langaro 49th Skytrain Station. Um, so if you plan your commute, it would be nice to just have a look and see if you can go through those stations because they're very close. Um, there's a cinema nearby and Queen Elizabeth Park is such a nice place. You can see um, all different kinds of uh, species of flowers and they also have a nice um, bird arboretum, I believe. So you can see rainforest um, plants and you can also see uh, different kinds of birds in there. Um, that's only a 10 minutes bus, bus ride. And we are also 15 minutes to downtown Vancouver, which is great because um, over the weekend, I think that's where you want to go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for the lounge, we also have a bathroom here. And there is another bathroom in one of the rooms as well. Uh, and I will show you as we, we move out um, because I mentioned that we have cameras all over the building. Um, like for example, here we can see one um, and we do check them regularly to make sure about your safety. Um, so safety is not a concern here. So we're going to be getting into turn the elevator again. We are very sorry if the connection is cut at any point. Um, so just stay with us for a little bit and we'll be back. We're going to go to the residence studio now and show you a section of studio. We are outside again, outside the buildings again. So we just saw our residence one over here and we are going to residence two, which is right across where we have just been. Uh, so yeah, let's get into residence two and I will show you a section studio. Okay, 
So as I mentioned downstairs, uh, we will now be seeing a section studio room. Okay. So this room is, like I said, a section studio. I'll show you a little bit and then I'll explain why it is called a section studio. Um, so as we go in, we first have a kitchen and this is a great chance for you to see all the appliances in your kitchen and what we will be providing to you. Um, so as you can see, there are a lot of pans, saucepan, pots, um, just a kettle, here is a toaster, a coffee machine. So there is lots that we provide for you here, which is great so you don't have to worry about, like, if you're moving across country, you don't have to worry about all of these, um, that's great. And like the other rooms, we have a nice microwave, so a stove top, we have an oven, and we also have a dishwasher. And so this is where you would have um, your food, hopefully. And yeah, more about the section concept, we can talk a little bit. So if we can just have the camera here. Um, so this, these rooms are called um, section because um, it is not a full wall. So off top, there's a little bit of uh, breathing space. And um, that is exactly why. So we can just go see the first room first. This one has a bunk bed. So, and these are one of our smart furniture. So this year you can see that it is a desk right now, um, but it can be converted into a bunk bed. So um, you would have to just arrange it a little bit and our caretaker is happy to help you. Um, and that way you can either use the space and if you wanna go up here, like so. I will say um, these studios are very popular with um, students and students that want to do the roommate matching program. And that is available through our website. So with the program, what we do is we ask you about your school and we also have some general questions like what time do you like to uh, sleep or are you a morning person or a night person? Um, do you like socializing, things like that. So we wanna make sure that you have someone that will um, respect you and hopefully have similar interests to you. And um, we try to place you with a student from the same institution and hopefully someone that stays as long as you do. So you don't have to keep changing roommates and that's, we, we try to make it a perfect match. Um, and over here is the balcony. It is actually very large too. Um, and just to note, not all of our suites have balconies. Um, most do, but not all. So when you're booking, um, please make sure you mention that you'd like a room with a balcony. So we have closet suite, uh, space available for uh, people who would be staying in this unit. And you can, um, it is quite large. And you can lock them if needed. That is something that we provide. And we can see the bathroom. Yeah. It is a bathtub again with the shower head, so we can use it both ways. Um, we provide a hair dryer here. And just like all of our suites, we have in-suite washer and dryer here. So like so. And over here, there is more closet space. And also, um, I don't know if I mentioned before, but 
We also provide, like in most of our suites, I think all, uh, we also provide a room um, and we have an iron. So some uh, cleaning supplies we provide as well. So you don't have to worry about much if you want to move into jeans. And the section studio is from 1200. And that is if you would like to book for four months or more. Uh, and like I said, our rates get cheaper if you book for a long term. And then they may be a little bit more expensive if you just want to stay for one month. But we do have that option if you would like a short term stay as well. Um, what else? And maybe I can just um, recap what is included in these suites again in case there's, there are some new people joining us. Um, so all of our suites are fully furnished and move in ready. We have Wi-Fi for you and it is free and all of the utilities are included within the rent. So um, electricity is included, water is included um, and Wi-Fi, like I said, whatever um, you think. And we also have on-site management, which is the caretaker that I mentioned. And we also have security. Um, and we have cameras installed everywhere. So there is no worries about um, your safety at all. We have underground parking and we have a gym available. And as I mentioned, the gym has a booking system right now, but um, the restrictions are loosening, so it may change sometime soon. Um, and with the events, please do follow us on social media because we host a lot of virtual events right now and we will get back into interesting events soon as well. Um, and we have another event coming up on July 8th. It's called Mafia. It is a social deduction game. So it is sort of like a murder mystery type um, event. And it's gonna be really fun. It is a great chance for you to meet um, all of our students. Okay. Are there any questions? Well, uh, there, there's a person asking about the private bedroom tour, okay. uh, but we don't have a private bedroom available right now. Okay. Uh, a section, so a section bedroom will be similar, just uh, the- Oh yeah, I mentioned that the, um, so we have, so right now we don't have any private bedrooms available in shared units. So that's not available, unfortunately. Um, but we do have this section unit that I'm showing you right now, and we have a lot more of these. So this is a, this has two private bedrooms as well. It is not exactly a bedroom just because um, there isn't a full wall, but there is some uh, space, some breathing room. So if you want, if you want to see it again. So like I said, this can be turned into uh, a two person bed, one bed, but you are able to use this room for one person. And um, because these bunk beds are convertible and then there are some options of, um, of just this twin bed as well, I believe. So that's something that I'd say definitely email or reservations team, uh, reservations at gecliving.com. So please do email them, uh, inquire with them, and they will try their best to um, accommodate you. And just because the availability, they, they know it better about the availability, it is best to contact them first. Any other questions? Can each room be locked individually? Yes. You can lock the room. Yeah, maybe I can recap um, the institutions we are close to. We are a 20 minute walk to Langara, and it is a five minute drive or an eight minute bus ride. Um, for UBC, it is an approximately 40 minute bus ride. 
for um, TPU, Portland Polytechnic University. Um, it is a 12 to 15 minutes um, SkyTrain commute. And like I said, we are very close to the SkyTrains here. Uh, for BCIT, it is a 30 minute transit. And for other schools in downtown, you can take the SkyTrain and get there in about 20 to 30 minutes. Any questions? No. Okay. We will hold a little bit more if you do have any questions. Uh, we are going to be announcing the winner on Friday and we will be giving away a $100 Apple gift card. So if you've been active on the chat section, that is great because we are choosing the winner from the chat section. Yeah, and for um, all of the other schools um, that weren't mentioned um, in the nearby schools, um, just make sure that you go to our event broad page or just go on our social media to book the other tours because we will be touring GEC Viva in downtown very soon. And it is very close to um, schools like VFS. Um, there's an SFU campus. There are a bunch of schools in downtown. Um, and also for Marine Gateway, um, it, would be, it would also be great for you to see. So please go on our social media and book those tours as well. Um, they will be happening very soon. Okay, thank you so much for joining us today and uh, touring GC Pearson with us today. Um, thank you for all of your questions. Hopefully you have an idea now about the apartments that we do offer. And if you have any other questions at all, don't worry and just um, contact us on social media because our marketing team and myself are gonna be active on social media. So we are happy to answer any questions you may have or just email our reservations team. It's reservations at jcliving.com. Um, if you would like to know a little bit more about our apartments and what we have to offer, you can also go on to our website, which is geciliving.com. So yeah, it was nice to tour with you guys today. See you in one of our other tours, hopefully. Bye.